The AMC Classic 8 movie theater, formerly known as the Altoona Carmike Cinema, unfortunately permanently closed its doors in July of 2021 due to COVID-related struggles. It last operated as a discount movie theater after the AMC 12 in nearby Duncansville opened up. As you all know, I try to give you an inside look while these places are still fairly untouched so that you can experience them as they were. In the case of this movie theater, it almost looks as if it's still in operation with very little damage and some electricity still on. This theater is in fantastic shape and could definitely be saved or operated as something else. I have faith that it will. I cannot express how much this theater meant to me personally growing up and how many weekends I spent here. I know that goes for thousands of others as well in the Altoona area. As a kid in the 90s and early 2000s, these theaters were the place to be. Not to mention the Logan Valley Mall is connected to it, allowing teenagers and adults alike to literally spend a full day shopping, eating, then ending the night with a movie, with your friends or a date. It was the way most kids I knew were spending the weekends growing up. When I heard about its closing, there was no question that I had to take the last look inside before it gets turned into something else. Feeling that last rush of nostalgia while I walk the grounds is what it's all about for me. I'm very appreciative to have the opportunity to document this local gem in its current state. So join me as we walk through and take the last look at the AMC Classic 8 movie theater. And a Blair County movie theater has decided to close its doors. The AMC theater located in the Logan Valley Mall has permanently closed. That's according to AMC's website. Now, if you're still wanting to catch a flick on the big screen, the AMC theater across from the convention center in Blair County is still open. lights. It's not every day that these places are still lit. You can see there's some damage. That's a shame, but
Pretty awesome that this place still has electricity on a little bit. Helps me out a little bit because Park Hills, the last theater, well not the last theater I filmed, but the theater a while back, a couple of years ago, was pitch black and I had a really crappy headlamp that didn't do anything. Obviously, I've never been in here, people, so you will have to bear with me. Not really sure where I'm going or what I'm looking at. Well, here's a... This goes down into the... All the seats still in there? I believe so. We'll be going down there shortly. I don't know why all these strange, the same one is everywhere. Wow, all right, so no projectors, but these are all the windows to all the, each individual theaters, which, seating and everything is still there. There's another one. Check that end. We have electricity. You know, I forget how many. How many screens there are in this in this place, but there's a, there's a lot. I didn't realize like I haven't been in here in forever. It's just going to end down here. Just check this out. One of these had, still has the catwalk. Um, I don't know if you call it a catwalk, but whatever. The walkway is still lit up. Let's find it. It's not this one either. These are the smaller ones, you know, for the movies that aren't fresh out the fresh out of Hollywood.
I always used to sit in the back row. Such a nice theater. It's all going to be pretty much the same, but it's still, uh, if I don't do it, I'll miss something. That's how it goes. Oh, here we go. This one has, it's still lit up. Let's turn this off. that this place could literally be opened back up today you know just a, a quick sweeping and mop job it could be opened back up today hoping to find one with a screen still intact. Hey, why not? We'll, we'll do the last one. This one has a little bit of damage. Still not. Not anything serious. Ceiling tile. Yeah. This one has the old love seat here. Sit with your date, you know, a little closer. Man. It's so crazy. I've seen so many movies in every single one of these. Typically, when I'm filming abandoned places, or places that have been closed for a long time, they smell very, very dingy and disgusting, and you know, you can taste it after you leave. But that's not the case with this place. Now the heat is no longer on, because why would you heat an empty theater? You can imagine how much it would cost to heat this place. And the electricity is only partially on, as you can see. But uh, this place is in really good shape. This is going to be the nicest theater I've ever done. And, you know, it's a shame that we're living in a time where theaters are no longer necessary because everybody has a television the size of a movie theater in their living room or basement. And... Um, 
yeah, it's just really sad, you know. And the, after the bowling alley that I did yesterday, it just really kind of bothers me that, you know, it seems like childhood is over. This bathroom's mint. See if the plumbing is turned off. Yeah, plumbing's off. Come out here and all your friends will be waiting for you to go to the bathroom and they're like, come on, man. Last look inside. Thank you for taking the last look inside of the AMC Classic 8 movie theater with me. Check it out, man. I mean, this merch is like really sick. Check me out, bro.